it's robotic time again and hundreds of robot companies around the world have gathered in China's capital Beijing to showcase the latest technology and by latest I don't mean those cracky robots serving you dishes I mean the real thing and look at this this is seems to be Xiaomi's CyberDog 2 released a few days ago but it's a bit different it changes color the CyberDog 2 is more dog-like than the previous model and can perform triple backflips. What's even more intriguing is that it's an open-source development platform, giving you the freedom to customize nearly everything to tailor it to your specific needs. The 2023 World Robot Conference was launched on Wednesday in Beijing, marking the largest and most internationally diverse iteration in the conference's eight-year history. Germany's Festo has returned to the show, introducing the maiden flight of its bionic Swift robot birds in Beijing. Simultaneously, local company Soft Robot Tech showcased their artificial heart, which is still in the development phase. The company employed new materials to minimize the risk of transplant rejection, combined with a unibody process to ensure durability for years to come. One of the most magical products at the show is a brain-machine interface, allowing individuals to control robots with their minds. We tested the machine designed to aid in the recovery of brain injuries by envisioning hand movements. Remarkably, the entire system requires no implants. Instead, users can complete the course while wearing this peculiar cap. As the robot show continues to grow, more international brands are joining the fest. South Korea's HD Hyundai has set up their first booth at the World Robot Conference, with aspirations to expand within the vast Chinese market.